Hi everyone. Uh, so today we're going to talk about the LEDs in the dashboards and the various options you have when uh, when you want to set them. So right now we're using the Corvette C7 dashboard as an example, and uh, you can see that there are eight LEDs in the display. Now the default setup for these LEDs is to go from the outside to the inside. Now you can also choose an automatic option for all the LEDs, in which case they go from left to right based on the maximum RPM of the car. Now in addition to changing the direction of the LEDs and the manual or the automatic nature of the LEDs, you can even change the colors used in each LED. So right now I have an automatic setting going from left to right and I change the colors to be green, yellow, and then red. Now you can do this with any car in the C1 dashboard, and the manual settings are set up to mimic what the actual dashboard would do, and the automatic settings are based around the maximum RPM of the car and uh, always move from left to right. So now let's talk about how you can set up your uh, car's LEDs to your liking. So when you're out of the car, uh, you click on the settings icon to open the, the settings dialog. Now there are two uh, important tabs here. The display tab, and if you look on the right of the, of the display tab, we have default LEDs. The options are manual, all 80 to 98, all 65 to 98, grouped 80 to 98, or grouped 65 to 98. This setting influences what happens when you choose a new dashboard. If you have it set to manual, then the default settings for that dashboard will be used for the LEDs. If you have it set to one of these automatic options, then this appropriate option will be applied to the dashboard regardless of what the default uh, LEDs should look like. Now just to go over what these four automatic options mean, uh, all means that each LED gets illuminated individually. Um, and the first one starts at 80% of maximum RPM, going up to 98% when they're all lit. This option starts at 65% of maximum RPM and goes up to 98% of the maximum RPM, and they're all being illuminated. Now the grouped ones do uh, bring up LEDs in groups, and depending on how many LEDs you have in your display, it be, could be two at a time, or three at a time, or even four or five at a time. And the 80 or the 65% starting is the same as for the all. Now in the car 2 tab, this is where you choose the individual dashboard. Now I selected the Corvette C7, that's the one I'm working on right now, screen number 1. So under the car 3, this shows me what the LEDs will do and how they'll be illuminated. So right now I am set to the automatic 80 to 98%. So that means the dashboard will automatically choose the appropriate RPMs to illuminate each LED from left to right. If I want to set them manually, I would choose the manual option here. And now, if I want to change the RPM, I can just go type in a new one. So if I want to work at 5000, I can do that. Or if I want to work at 5100, I can do that. And each LED will illuminate at the appropriate RPM. Now if I want to change the color of an LED, all I have to do is click on the LED I'm interested in changing. So say this particular one here, I click on this, you get this color option. Now say I wanted it to be a different color, this sort of reddish purple, I can choose that. And let's say I want the same one for that particular uh, display, for that particular LED. And now I click OK, and my settings have been saved. So now when I'm in the car, you can see that the LEDs are going to the center and that the middle LEDs have changed color to the reddish purple that I had selected. Uh, so thank you for watching this video and please subscribe to our YouTube channel.